Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh uh, Today we gonna share the result of our discussion Discussion about implementation biological control on cabbage uh, Before we start the presentation I will introduce the member of group First is me, Rivan Darmawan and then Desi Cahyanti, Anissa Erikawati, and Siva Virus Zahra. Background Kibit is one of the important vegetables in Indonesia and is a widely cultivated and consumed by the public because the vegetables are known as a source of vitamin, mineral, carbohydrate, protein, and fats which are very useful for health. Uh, there are many pests and diseases on cabbage. If it not control the damage caused by pests and diseases will increase, the farmer will, e will experience crop failure. Farmer generally deal with pests and diseases attack by using synthetic pesticide. Biological control is one of the component in IPM that is environmentally sound so that it can reduce the impact of unwanted insecticide use. Biological control. Biological control is a pest management strategy that can benefit both of conventional and organic agriculture. Biological control utilizing their natural enemies, such as predator, parasite, and pathogen. The use of biological control has been widely used in Indonesia to support integrated pest management policies or as also known as integrated pest management, which are environmentally friendly. Several types group of insects can control the population of other insects that become plant pest organism. Uh, Cabbage in general. Cabbage from the Brassicaceae family is a vegetable plant in the form of soft stem plant known since ancient time and is a plant referred and glorified by the people of ancient Greece. Uh, the kingdom is Plantae, Divisius Prespermatopita, Subdivisionis Angiospermae, class Dicotyledon, or there is Papa Furales, family is Cruciferae, genus is Brassica, species is Brassica oleracea. Uh, according to Sarjono, 2011 the most important requirement for cabbage to grow well are loose soil containing organic matter humid and low temperature pest of cabbage and control first is tritip caterpillar tritip caterpillar is a cabbage plant pest that attack plants are at the larva stage this pest damage the cabbage plant by eating the leaf the newly hatched larvae will eat the lower leaf surface, except for the leaf bone and upper epidermis. The, the attack of this larva causes bad spot in the leaf so that over time leaf, the leaf becomes hollow because the remaining epidermis becomes dry. Adult larva sometimes damage a cabbage shoot, make holes in the crop and eat cabbage flower. They are several ways that can to be to control the specific attack. Number one, the biological method by maintaining and utilizing natural animals of pets. Number two, the technical culture method can be done by intercropping between tomatoes and chewings or refusing female moths to lay eggs to chewing plants. In addition, trapping pests can also be planted with collard greens or black, black mustard or ripe. Number three, the technical method is carried out by giving insecticides result which are zero point left uh, per sample plant. Okay, number two, tapilar head or tapping head. Your left consultor on the underside of tubing left 
uh, lipstick fetish on the edible left the old star left uh, dispress and attack the sword of the chipping plan destroying the glowing point as a result the plan is or the chipping system from the brandes and some small pots the attack of sea beyond beyond or chipping place that have formed a crop will destroy the crop or resident the quality of the crop so that chipping is not so okay the method of controlling the chapillar in cultivar plants is almost the same and controlling the cut caterpillar include uh, number one physical and medical control by technique group uh, of act killing left and imago or removing host plant that are attacked by crossing capillars number two plant management in technical culture be planting past resistant varietas using healthy set cropping radiation and implementing and stantation number three is raising of natural animals plants parasitoid predator and pathogen number three are involved subdeptorally to ratis catholic damage and eating living or so the septum all of hollow hollow left up the and ever bonus uh, to the left at the left the capillator attack both young and both jumping are coding to agriculture, resins, and development canter. Army control can be applied to component of intricate pest management (APM), including a technical culture control, b physical and medical control, c biological control. Okay, number four is the jengkal caterpillar. The larva are green with white stripe on the side. The characteristic of this larva is when it walks like a stretch. Symptoms of attack caused by Chrysodixis oricalcaea. The larva will damage and it leaf so that the attack leaf become hollow, starting from the upper of or lower leaf edge. Nah, jengkal caterpillar control teknik the first one is uh, cropping pattern is by sitting the planting time so that the vegetative stage is at the same time and the, uh, the second one is mechanical method with a planting corn as a trap and the number three is collection and destruction of age and larva and the number four sanitize with to reduce the possibility of other host plant and number five is application of nuclear polyhydrosis virus as a biological again several types of parasitoid of <coughs> can also be used for example trichogarma as egg parasite and cotesia sp as larva parasite application of recommended in insecticide registered and permitted by the Minister of Agriculture if it has exceed the economic result as above the next the number five is apis apis attack cabbage plant by breaking their pro point moon part and shocking the cell food, causing yellowing of the larva and the mold crop look dirty. A bit prefer to feed on the other side of the larva on the leaf on and or on the other side of the leaf near the growing point. A bit con control can be done by the first one is 
technical control can be done by investing natural enemies such as Creson, a parasitoid, Apelinus gossipi, entopatogenic fungus, Neogisetis freseni, or predatory Coccinella transversalis. And the second one is chemical control can be done by spraying insecticide containing fipronil or diaventiorun and preferably spraying it in the afternoon and the next is a cabbage disease and the control and the first one is club root disease the rate of production of cabbage is often affected by the attack of the pathogen plasmodiopora brassicae uh, which cause swelling of the root Swelling of the root tissue can interfere with root function such as translocation of nutrient and water from the soil to the leaf. This situation cause plant will stunt, dry out, and eventually die. A chloprotesis can con- uh, control can be done by the number one is a cutilage with balanced fertilization, fertilization so as to suspend the growth of this pathogen. Number two is biological I can see by spraying in the form of corin from the beginning of planting. And number three is control is uh, done by using seeds that are free of pests and disease. Number four is uprooting disease plant and the last is I uh, use a trap plants and the treatment of the nursery soil with solarization technique have also been proven to reduce disease and increase crop yield and then uh, number two is black root disease in the, in the nursery the first infection appears namely in the cotyledons turning black uh, seedlings that are attacked by pathogen will be allowed to burn to brown with and then wither and die plants uh, that enter advanced vegetative growth will show stone symptoms wilting and infected a leaf are sap like letter V this V region then enlarges and goes to the base of the leaf stem root and turns back to to the multiplying pathogen young infected leaf experience stunt grow yellow to brown in color wilt and die prematurely uh, control can be done by the first one is cultivating among others includes cropping patterns and crop times and um, second one is use of healthy seed and water management then eat the seed treatment by soaking the seed in warm water at 52 or for uh, 20 minutes or 50 50 celsius for uh, ter- 30 minutes. Okay, the next one is Alternia leaf spot causes by Alternia brassicae. This disease causes small patches of dark gray and white moldy color. This disease occurs predominantly in the in the older leaf and will accelerate the onset of root. On the leaf and stem will be the form of central ring. For controlling this disease, cultivar reaction test relieved that OS cross CV was the most resistant cabbage cultivar, while baladi CV was the most susceptible one. Biological control studies indicated that bacterial isolate or B1 and bacillus subtilis, as well as their culture fill rates, proved to be the highly effective in reducing abrasiola, spora, germination, and sub. sub- Subsequently, reducing the disease parameter in vivo, followed by trichoderma and tiharzianum, respectively. Next one is downy mildew, caused by jamur peronospora parasitica. 
primary symptom of downy mildew are irregular yellow necrotic patches with white fungal growth on young leaf or cotyledons. The growth of conidispora and conidia is occurring on the under surface of the leaf, but in in favorable condition, the both sides of the leaf can be affected. The disease uh, is more severe on young plants, and this can result in the death of seedlings. This downy mildew disease can control by four ways. The first one is crop rotation. The next one is managed irrigation. The next one is applied pseudomus and uh, are able to show risk the in- intensity and severity of downy mildew disease. The last one is organic para infective fungicides. Okay, the last one is wet root disease caused by bacteria Erwi- Erwinia carotophora. The leaf upper brown or blacklist root and uh, infection occur. The patches and right and in and form irregular growth. High humidity causes ba- causes the sore tissue to look wet and brown. This wet root disease can control by two ways. The first one is maintaining the cleanliness of the environment and cultivation system, adjusting the spacing so that is it is not too tight, and carrying out the plant sanitation. Uh, the next one and the last one is using antagonistic micro- microorganism like plant growth promoting uh, rhizobacteria or PGPR and Pseudomus florens. Okay, this is the conclusion of our discussion. Biological control or biocontrol is a pest management strategy that can benefit both convent- uh, conventional and organic agriculture. By encouraging the role of natural enemies, the negative impact of the pest on the crop reduced. Biological control utilizing their uh, natural enemies or biological control against, such as predators, parasitoid, parasite, uh, and pathogen. Pests and diseases that attack cabbage include three-top caterpillar, caterpillar uh, head or cabbage herd, army worms, jungle caterpillar. Epids, club, di- club root disease, black root disease, alternia leaf spot, downy mildew, and wet root disease. Pests and disease on cabbage can control by bi- biological control, utilizing their natural enemy or biological control again, such as predators, parasites, and pathogens. Okay, thanks. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.